<laughs> well, now on to this story, abundance. It is a word to describe a very large quantity of something, but if you look closely, you can also read the word as a bun dance. Well, those two descriptors perfectly capture the inspiration behind the modern Chinese cuisine now being served at an iconic Cleveland Heights foodie destination. Our Doug Trackner gives us a front row look at the new home of Abundance Culinary. We're in Cleveland Heights on a beautiful spring day. We're walking to the diner on Lee Road, which has seen a lot of restaurants over the years. Now it's called Abundance. Let's go check it out. Well, Chef Fong, Carl, thank you for having me in your kitchen. Thank so, you for coming today. You guys have such an incredible backstory about how you met, where you met. Can you tell us a little bit about that? We met 2004 in the middle of China in a small city that's called Shiyan. Chef Lu Fang and Carl Setzer are now partners in life and in business. By the time we fell in love and got married, I was actually working in information security. We both had jobs that our parents wanted us to have. But an interest in home brewing eventually led the pair to change directions and open the first craft brewery in Beijing. We wanted to use Chinese raw materials and using Chinese ingredients and Chinese stories into our beer. That brought us closer to a massive uh, base of Chinese cu customers. So massive, in fact, that by 2017, they had four locations, and Great Leap Brewing was poised to become China's largest craft brewery. What happened? What brought you back here to uh, Cleveland, Ohio? Uh, so, COVID happened, and then, like, overnight, like, China just shut down. And we got that notice on February the 10th, and we packed everything, got on a plane on February the 12th. A great leap of their own, moving their family back to Carl's Northeast Ohio roots, where they discovered an abundance of culinary resources at their fingertips. There's so much in this area, like, so much more than what an ordinary, like, Chinese chef would dream of having on a daily basis. Add that to a food scene that welcomed them with open arms, thanks to local chefs like Jeremy Amansky, who encouraged them to begin a regular pop-up at his deli and bakery, Larder in Ohio City. And so how's that early reception? People come in, they, uh, you know, maybe they were expecting Larder, maybe they weren't. Absolutely, like, it has been very overwhelmingly, like, warm and accepting experience for me. They also connected with chef and restaurateur Doug Cass, who presented them with the chance to take over the kitchen space here at the diner on Lee where they're now drawing these loyal customers to the east side. That, you know, opened up more of an opportunity just to be able to put more things in the menu and more of like a family setting. All in a space happily shared with Rising Star Coffee Roasters. And so through this kitchen and through this opportunity, she's going to be able to provide more and more items that are going to be very nostalgic for a lot of people, but are also going to be the first time an uh, even larger segment of consumers are ever going to have those flavors. So. Doug, we have four dishes here, so I would recommend us going with the dumplings first. It's tender, it's so flavorful inside, oh, and the beef is so tender. Good, good, good. And this is the Sichuan sausage bun. This is easily one of our most popular buns. So pretty. Uh, thank you. Yeah, all of the dough is handmade, hand rolled. We also tried a beautiful noodle dish made with pork belly, dry rubbed with spices, and slow cooked. And speaking of spice, Chef Fang's China hot chicken is not to be missed. My inspiration was more of the Nashville hot. It's like a steady building heat. It's not like, yeah. not rock your face off. No. I can handle a lot of spices. It's just it's like a nice, mellow building. Yeah. And the I mean, this is some of the crunchiest, crispiest chicken wings I've had. Oh, awesome. Thank you. And then you. you get through it and you have like beautifully moist. Yeah. Like this is not fried chicken. It's just, awesome. these, are, these are a joy to eat. Well, thank you for having me. Thank you. No, thank you for coming. It's my pleasure. Looks good, doesn't it? Abundance is open Thursday through Saturday from 11 a.m. to 8 p.m. and on Sundays from 11 a.m. to 6 p.m.